Okay. Let's wing this thing. What about it, YouTube? <laughs> I haven't said that in a long time. I've had this insane urge, like overwhelming urge to, to make another one of these. It's like the only fear I have in my life right now is talking to my camera or you, YouTube. It's the only fear I have and it's driving me nuts so this has been years in the making like years I've had this urge to make these videos and I think they could just be called an update video I mean I'm, I'm, I don't have the patience or the, the drive or the I just couldn't be a vlogger there's no way I could be a daily vlogger it's just I am fascinated by the people that do it I appreciate the people that do it, it provides me hours and hours of entertainment I learned so much from amazing people like Peter McKinnon, Casey Neistat, uh, shit, there's a guy named Levi, big inspiration of mine. So years, I've been struggling with this. Just the idea of getting in front of my camera and talking, and I think I figured out why. Today, as a matter of fact. So me and my son was talking, Brennan, and uh, I'm always sharing my secrets and my, my insecurities and uh, just exposing them to my children. I want them to know that I'm not perfect, I'm scared too. And, and this is a process of me overcoming my fears because we all have them, every one of us. I mean, we're just a combination, a big ball of insecurities. You watching right now have got your insecurities. I know it because I see very confident people get in front of my camera and have minor meltdowns and they become a very insecure version of themselves. And so my job is to make them feel confident. My job is to make them believe that I'm gonna make them look good. And that's what my goal is every single time. So I guess I can do the same thing for myself. <laughs> uh, maybe another highly edited video, I'm not sure. I don't make attempts at things I don't believe I'm going to succeed at. So I don't, I don't play sports. I was terrible at football, so I don't do that. If I'm not good at it, I'm not doing it, which is so stupid. So my fear here was this. I'm afraid to put something out that's not as good or better than everything else out there. I'm afraid of judgment. How stupid is that? Although if I have a hundred people that love it, one person doesn't love it, I'm curious about that one person. I'm hyper-focused on that one person. And God dang it, I wanna get past that. I gotta, I gotta learn to let go. And I feel better because even the biggest, the greatest, the most you know, confident celebrities in our mind, it, they feel the same way. We're all the same. You feel the same way, I feel the same way. We're the same. So I realized how stupid it was that I'm worried that I'm not going to be good enough or better than, better than. I just want to be good enough. And I think, how stupid? How am I ever going to get any better unless I make an attempt, unless I start making these videos? I mean, I'm, I'm three minutes, six minutes into this conversation. And matter of fact, all the anxiety, all the stress from my gut, that cortisol that's being pumped around my stomach, so I already feel better that I'm having this conversation. So. That's good. Maybe we can move on to something else. I was thinking about this. I thought if there's someone out there that may want to know about what it is I have going on, maybe we can start a dialogue. Maybe we can start a conversation. Maybe I can fill you in. You know, I was just here shooting a music video a few weeks ago. I may give you a behind the scenes. This is my revenge, the reason I exist. Why didn't I document that? How hard would it have been to pull out a phone? Hey guys, blah, blah, blah. You know, a little behind the scenes. So you can see it's not magic, you know what I mean? It's me and a camera, a few lights, a few friends, and we make this thing happen. You may have thought, oh, fuck, I can do that too. Maybe I shouldn't cuss so much. I don't, I don't like the idea of that. I hope you're okay with me just using bleeps. I love those adjectives, they, they help me. It's just filler. I was thinking I could just share more, maybe the projects that I have going on. Maybe you're interested, but I'm really excited because I have so many amazing things happening and I have some amazing people helping me. You may get to know them soon. So anyways, this is me. So, you know what, I have a, I have something. I learned something from, uh, I'm not sure who wrote it, but I know Tony Robinson shared it on YouTube. And uh, you know what, I'll just show you. Okay, so this is it, P-A-R-C. So this is what I learned, that's you. That's your full potential. How do you increase it? And this is how I've made, basically made it through everything in my life. The secret is, is to go clockwise. Take action. With that action, there will be a result, no matter what. It doesn't matter if it's a good or bad result. Either way, there's gonna be a result and you're gonna learn from it and you will increase your certainty, which will obviously expand your potential. The thing is, is I think you learn more from doing something wrong the first time. Take action, understand what you did wrong through your result, 
and understand how to fix it. Your certainty is always going to go up. The problem is, most people, including me, like in this case, why haven't I been making videos? Well, because I went to certainty first. Are people going to like them? Are people going to laugh? Am I going to be judged? We don't want to do that. I am going to blindly take action and see what the results are. We learned something from it. There we go. To continue on with my conversation, so I thought we could go for a little ride. My favorite thing to do in the whole wide world is to um, drive. Back roads, I love the back roads, my, by far. Get a nice little drink, today it's coffee, and just cruise, man. Do some thinking, listen to some music, work out our problems. It really, I use it to, um, I think I've made every video I've ever made was, in, was driving. I listen to the song. I make videos the same way you daydream. It's the same exact thing. I daydream, I see fragments, those fragments are enough to kind of tell a story. I, if I can see it, I can shoot it. Huh? Pretty sweet, huh? I like that. I shot a video here. You, you have so probably long. never seen it. Oh, it's shaking like crazy. May sound like shit, we'll find out soon now, won't we? A little sideways? Oh shit, trash control. Here we go. Oh, we got too many gears there. Little fishtail going, y'all may see. Oh my god, look here. How irris how irresponsible. See, I'm off track again. This is another reason why I'm not gonna be worth a shit at making these videos. I can't have a coherent thought of once again. Going back to what we were talking about, why I'm making these videos. To overcome this fear of making videos. Because I'm worried of judgment. I'm worried whether or not my videos are gonna be good enough. And by videos me. Am I going to be good enough? Am I going to be interesting enough? And I really don't have to worry too much about that because I'm really only interested in targeting a handful of people. And that's those of you that are curious and that maybe want to do this too. A lot of people ask me about helping on my videos and I've got to start including that. But I thought maybe I could take you on this journey. Let me say I can't go back, but we can start here because now is when amazing things are happening. I have some unbelievable people in my life that truly believe they're making me believe in myself. I thought from now on, let's start documenting it. Maybe once a week. Maybe we do a video once a week, keeping you updated, keeping you posted. I thought about doing some Instagram things. I've never done an Instagram story. Maybe that's the place to do it. I'm not sure. I'm a little long-winded, I think, for Instagram. So let me ask you a question. Is this something you'd like to see more of? Whoever you are. I have an idea of a couple of you, because we speak, obviously. But anybody else out there? Are you, I mean, are you like me? Are you curious to how people do the things they do? Is there something about I, what I do that you find interesting? I would love to share. I mean, my God, my favorite topic is me. I mean, I can talk about me all day long. Are you kidding me? Oh, dear, 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 dear. Wish I had my phone. Oh, look how pretty. Look how pretty. Stay there. Don't move. Stay there. No. Come back. Come back. Come here. You should have. Can you see that? Can you see that? Can you see that? Are they? Got spots all over. Yeah. Anyways. So, if you enjoyed it, leave a like. If you didn't, f you. If you have a question, leave it in the comments. Um, 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 um. If you just want to say hello, do that in the comments as well. Anyways, I really appreciate you watching. I hope you enjoyed. No shit. It's a lot. It's hard for me to do this. So, uh, good luck. No. That, why am I telling you good luck? Maybe I need the good luck. I've got a van on my ass making me go fast. Ooh, that kind of rhyme. I need a way to get out of this video. Bye. Is that good enough? I know what it is. Mm, should I give that away? I've got a... a mm, I don't know if I want to share this. Somebody's going to steal it. I've always wanted to get a sailboat call it SV SLB which is sailing vessel so long bitches what do you think you like that maybe that's the way I could just end all my videos until next time so long bitches <laughs>